Hello, hello guys, and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial, guys, I will be showing you how to actually autocomplete your script automatically in Visual Studio Code. So, what we're going to talk about today is, for example, you write A in your script, and you will have automatically, for example, array written for you. Or you write uh, P and automatically print is written for you. So that's exactly what I'm going to show you today. So first, before we get into that, we need to set up our software. So to download Visual Studio Code, you only need to go to your browser, go to the URL section and search for Visual Studio Code from here. And guys, please don't make any mistakes between these two softwares logo. This one is for Visual Studio Code and this one is for Visual Studio. So today we are going to use Visual Studio Code. So go to, go to code.visualstudio.com. So click here. And basically, guys, all you need to do is download it here for Windows. If you have any other system, please make sure to check it out from this uh, arrow in over here. So this list will give you Mac OS, Windows X64, and Linux X64. After you download it, install it, and then create your account, and you will be ready and set it up. Now, what you'll have to do in order to have your your script so let's have a new file and let's open uh, the open folder not a folder let's open actually a file so here it is now let me just remove all of this and yeah as you can see guys if i write anything here it will give you a bunch of things to auto complete so for me to auto complete all i need to do for example is something like that i'm not even writing anything so print i don't know you can just do something like that hello world of course he can't come also complete your words but as you can see here here you can search as search ibs uh, anything like anything for example if statement here it is um else f as you can see um else uh, exit if i want here for example return here it is um yeah this is like buttons and or unlimited options of word that you can have them auto completed for you guys so yeah guys that was it for today's video that was completely how you can auto complete your words in visual studio code so thank you guys for watching if you have any other questions please leave them down below in the comment section and see you guys in the next tutorial